I want to talk to you, I know I get approached quite often, actually, about people who work at a, a very mature facilities, right? These facilities are just cranking out massive amounts of products. And uh, they're really like set, right? They, they're not doing lots of upgrades because they make a product, they make it well, and they just make lots of it, right? So it could be cans that you that soft drinks go into. It could be nails and screws. I mean, I've been to all kinds of plants where they're doing this. And in these facilities, they have typically slick 500s or PLC5s, right? And again, there's facilities that use every different type, Omron, you know, every different, you know, Wago, every different type Siemens, every different type of PLC that has, has, are in facilities like this. But the ones I work with, just because of my background, have been really a PLC 5, SIG 500 focused plants. And, you know, today everybody focuses on the new stuff, right? Which makes sense, right? That's what, that's what uh, new and exciting, and that's what people focus on. But so what do you do, though, if you're in one of these old plants and you want to learn the SIG 500 and PLC 5? Well, one of the things I tell people is, you know, you can get the RS Logix Micro Starter Late Edition software free. It, it's almost identical to the Slick 500 and PLC5 software. The PLC5, the IO is a little bit different. But I mean, it, you'd be hard pressed looking over somebody's shoulder to tell the difference between this free software and the software for the Slick 500 and PLC5. And so not only can you get that software, right? You may not have a Micro Logix 1000 or 1100 hanging around to use with it. Um, because that's the limitations of the free software. But you can also get the free uh, emulator with it too. So I wanted, in today's tech tip, I wanted to show you how to do that. If you are somebody who has to learn Slick 500s, PLC 5s, then this would be a great way to just install it on your computer at home and maybe uh, teach yourself how to use it. So let me show you how to go through and do that. So what we want to do is we want to go to ab.com and I'll take you to this website here. I believe it's Rock Automation dot com forward slash Ellen Bradley or something like that. But in any case, go to ab.com. That'll redirect you here. And what we want to do is we want to go to support. Okay, I'm going to click on that. I'm going to go to product support and I'm going to go for the drivers and firmware. Now, why am I going there? Well, you'll see in a moment. You'll see in a moment. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to type in 1763. That is the Micrologics 1100. Okay. And uh, it's a great little PLC, right? So I'm going to select that, and then I'm going to select Firmware 10. I believe the downloads we are looking for are under 10 and 11. So I'm going to click on Download. Okay, and then, right, if I click on Downloads, right, I'm going to see that I get some options. Okay, and I actually got to put my glasses on to read this because the text is so small. But um, if you look down here, you're going to see... RS Links Classic Light for Micrologix, right? You'll check that. Unfortunately, it's very large, but you need it. RS Logix Emulate 500, that's the free PLC emulator. And then you're gonna wanna choose RS Logix Micro Starter Light. Don't get, the, don't get the Chinese one, you want the English one if you speak English. If you speak Chinese, then get the Chinese one. Okay, and uh, you can see emulates here again too. Um, but in any case, you want those three items and you can download those all you need is a log in the Rockwell's website. You actually don't have to have a spot contract. And then you'll be able to install them on your home computer. Now, while they don't officially support Windows 10, I've used them on Windows, Windows 10 without issues. I mean, if you're not an administrator on your PC, you're going to have a hard time installing any software. But in any case, most people are administrators on their own PC. And uh, it should work on Windows 10 Home. Now, I haven't tried Windows 11. I'm not, uh, I'm not living on the bleeding edge trying to run a company here. I don't want to be the first to figure everything out on Windows 11. But uh, in any case, um, I did want to share that with you. And if you're looking for these steps, you know, I've documented them over at theautomationblog.com. You can see it right here. And the name of the article is How to Download RS Logix Micro, RS Links, and Emulate 500 for free. It's a 2021 edition updated because Rocco continuously updates their website. So I've kind of gone through here. You can see even some of these selections are a little bit older. And, um, but again, you want to come down here to version 10 and you want to go to downloads and, uh, and check those boxes. So that is a great way if you have a plant full of Slick 500s, PLC 5s, maybe even Micrologics, and you want to learn them, you can get the software for free, you get the emulator for free, and you can play with it offline. So I wanted to share that in today's tech tip. And until next time, my friends, peace.